Microsoft Link, Establishing Contact and Pinning Frequent Contact. The first time you log into Microsoft Link, you won't see anybody listed. You'll need to search for these contacts and find the people that you want to make available. All you need to do is start typing their name or email address in this field. I'm going to right click on this one and add to contacts list. All contacts. I could add more and I can select more than one at once. Right click, add to contacts list, all contacts. From here I'm going to expand my view a little bit so I can see things a little more easily. Frequent contacts are automatically added to this group. You could, however, drag them into this area if you know that you're going to be talking to this person a lot. Another option is to right-click, Pin to Frequent Contacts. I can expand or collapse these lists. I can also change my privacy relationship with this person. As a friends and family, a work group, colleagues, external contacts, even block contacts, or I could have it auto assign the relationship. And this will give people different permissions for when they're trying to contact me or check on my availability. Within this menu, I could also remove somebody from my contacts list, remove them from the group, or move them to a different group. I can also view their contact card, which will have information about what they're up to, how to contact them in other ways, as well as what their calendar looks like, and even their location. I can organize my contacts by group, by status, and by relationship. And that is how to establish contacts and pin frequent contacts in Microsoft Link.